ladies and gentlemen, it's time for True Syndrome Monday today. We're taking stock of the year so far. Mm -hmm. Hence the question. Ah, what are your goals for the second half of the year, 2024? Yeah, the beginning of the year. <sighs> people usually make goals. Some people say they don't call it goals. They make it as a New year resolution. Yeah, whatever the case may be. So this is the second part of the year. Have you been able to achieve some, or do you still have more that you're planning to achieve? That's why we're asking this question. What are your goals for the second part of the year? Okay. So for the first half, uh, I didn't really put anything in mind. My, goal, my major goal was just to be focused and see what I could do and try to stop procrastination. And I have improved when it comes to procrastination. Yes, I've noticed that. And I've been able to achieve one or two other things. But for this second half of the year, uh, I don't really want to put any particular thing in mind. I just want to stay focused and then make more time for myself. Maybe go on holiday or something. Yeah. <sighs> New Year resolution in the mud. <laughs> yeah, I, I, there were some things I could have done, but I've not still done them. So this whole second part of the year, uh, nothing, nothing at the moment. Yeah. Uh, what I would just say is, yeah, what I intended doing was have time for myself, hmm. prioritize myself more than others, but kinda. I still don't think I have gotten there. So maybe the remaining part of the year, I will focus more on myself and my growth. Yeah. That's what I it is. So myself, my growth for mm -hmm. the remaining part of the year. So help me, Ja. Amen. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> and that's our truth. After this break, we'd also love to hear from you watching as phone lines will be open. We'll also be checking out your Facebook and X messages. We are TVC Connect on X at TVC Entertainment on Facebook using the popular hashtag eSplash on TVC. Let's find out what people on the street have to say. TSM, it's Truth Syndrome Monday. Before the year started, I had plans that were concerning my physical life, spiritual life, and relationship with other people. So spiritually, I planned on equipping myself in my prayer life. Physically, I planned on doing 10 push-ups per day, but then I've not been consistent, but then I, I hope to continue. My goals for the next half is to keep improving myself. So there is one thing I tell myself, Seka, you're always evolving, so keep doing that. And um, one of the ways I intend to do that is to pursue all of, all of my career goals the remaining half of the year. You know, go harder. Do the stuff that I need to do to get me to where I need to be. My goal for the second of years is to be, to be alive, because when there's life, there's hope. So if I'm alive, my, my, hope, my hope for this year is that like, I should be alive to see the end of this year. That's all. When is life day zoo? My goal is to work harder, to make a lot of money, and to hang out with my friends and just to chill. That's basically it. That's basically it. It doesn't mean I'm slacking off, well, but that's just basically it. To work hard, to make money. I would love to move closer to God, first of all, because like people tend to not talk about God. So like I want to move closer to God, and I believe that anything you put in God's hands is good to go. So, mm, only what I pray for is good earth. I want to own my own business. Like I want to start my own cosmetic stuff. So at least by the end of the year, I want to see myself in my own shop and making more money by the end of the year. I want to graduate and um, do my master's in chemistry for my education. I want to be the best version of myself. I just feel like there are a lot of a lot of, a lot of things I've not achieved yet. I want to be the best version of myself. My business, I do gadget, so I want to I want to achieve a lot more in that field. I want to start my business. I want to um, make my degree first class. Yeah, that's basically it. TSM, it's Truth Syndrome Monday. So, so it's the last lady for me. It was the way she started, like, um, I want to start my business. She has a nice voice, by the way. Do you know, at the point, I thought it was, I want to make a request to my mommy and my daddy. But yeah, I wish her the very best. I wish all of them the very best. Yeah, um, that girl that wants to open a cosmetic store. Hmm. OK, um, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Um, the question we're asking today <laughs> on Choosing Syndrome Monday is, 
What are your goals for the second half of the year 2024? Totally go, um, agree with that guy that said we always try to avoid that conversation of about talking about God, getting yeah. closer to God. Every all of you used to start the year that Lord, this is the year mm -hmm. I will draw closer to you, draw me nearer, draw me nearer. And after January, you're mm -hmm. back to the world. Mm -hmm. God is watching you. All right, it's now time to take some reactions. I'm on X. Tommy Your G says, My plans for the rest of the year is to plan how I will survive and strategize for 2025. Mm. Make nobody pressure me. <laughs> we agree. Um, B. Ofoga says, mine is to continue making more money. Mm, nice. So you get money, you want to make more great stuff. Pakakali says, good day, gang. As for me, Mr. Kelly, my goals, are for the, my goals for the second half of the year is to buy more shares from different organizations. Uh, uh. I need more money to take care of so many things that I have plans for, e.g. my lady Kath and ETC. Oh, okay. Wait, to. Oh. Okay, yeah. King Oje, on my bed, did you see anything with the name Pakakali, eh? No, we didn't. So, it was shouting my lady Kath, my lady Kath, all in a wash. I know they get... It's gets, in the air. I don't get involved in people's relationship. Wow. Yeah. There's no relationship, actually. Oh. Yes, exactly. Okay, yes. but he wants to make, get, make, need more money to take care of many things that I have plans for, e.g. my lady cat. Eh. Okay, on to the next message. Um, investor Adegoke says, my goal for the second half of 2024 is to get out of this one room I'm living to get a home of my oh. own. Eh, you better... St second okay. half. Is it one room in your parents' house? True, Sha, not that I'm good. Because if you are staying in your parents' mm. house still, my guy, mm. don't go and form you want to be on your own because you want to be going out. You want to be opening your door yourself. Mm. Sakpa, Sakpa, <laughs> do you have more? Yes, I have messages on Facebook. Munira Tiaya says, I'm not asking for too much. Get my local oven, mixer, and scale, and by God's grace, I will get a shop. Amen. I wish you the very best. Uh, Deshino says, Make one million before the end of the year. <laughs> wow. To do what? Wait first, how do you want to make the one million? Share the strategy with me if it's feasible. Let's make more than one million. <laughs> yeah? First take, Laura says, Good afternoon, Lady Cat. Am I one and only OJ? One and only. You are far too kind. <laughs> <laughs> my goals for the second half of the year is one, yeah? going back to my ex girlfriend for reconnection. <laughs> Two, meeting David Obot, Omo. That's one, eh? You know, fear happen. There are two more, but let's pick this call. We have Balaji on the line. Hello. Good afternoon, Balaji. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. So, what are your goals for the remaining half of the year, 2024? My goal is to survive. You will need to speak up, Balaji. Sorry, yeah. Can you project? My my goal is to survive. Nothing more than so, to survive. Mm. Yes. Don't to we survive. all? Don't we all need to survive? Mm -hmm. But Balaji, you there right yes. now? You don't chop today now. Oh, yes, that man. You don't chop, Balaji. You see me? Wait till you chop. <laughs> yeah. What do? Eh? What do? We. I didn't hear that, Balaji. Oh. Okay, you know what? You need to call us back because yes, we're struggling to hear you. Yes. Bolaji, you don't chop, you'll survive. Bolaji has eaten. Bolaji <laughs> sounds like someone that has eaten. I eat every day, three square meals. Before. From the voice, you know. <laughs> All right, still back on Facebook, Festic. Laura says, number three. Hmm. Says, bombing my clients, like with my goods. Like bombing them, like being in their face. I don't think that's what it meant. I hope that's what it meant. Okay. Yes, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> and number four, hmm, he wants to jack go Canada. Huh. Wow. Um, first thing, so you want to go back to your ex-girlfriend? Mm -hmm. For reconnection. Hmm. You want to meet David Doe? He said, I'm a damn one, I know if you happen. No, it's possible now. It's uh, possible. It's not OB. Are you not 30 BG? Don't, okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dara Bell says, getting admission into FUTA. Mm. Well, uh, if you get good grades, of course, you get admission, so wish you the best. And please read your book, so, because mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. not by mm -hmm. paper. And uh, that Richie Jaden says, good afternoon, Lady Kath and OJ. Good afternoon. My goals for this second half of the year is one, as at least one, going back to Canada. But before I go, I, <laughs> I go first come UBA Bank because they don't show me and my bank account shaggy. Wow. So he wants to scam bank. 
Mba ingoba. Which is not good. You ah. will get arrested. Thank you. Why? What? Okay, yeah. Number two. Ah, now nah, wow. People are doing reconnection. This is number two. Getting back my girlfriend. What's the problem with you people losing your girlfriends and going back? So, I was somewhere and people were having a conversation <sighs> about they would prefer the devil that they know than starting all over. Mm. Yeah, so they say it's better to confront your demons than start all over because talking stages is headache. So do you like the lights on or off? Are you going back to go and run one or two? Or you are going oh. back to go and continue where people stop? He said getting back my girlfriend. Hmm. Maybe he wants I don't back. trust all of you going back home. Maybe all his friends are getting married and doesn't want to start all over. Sha? <laughs> Number three. Wow, going to MTN office to sack them because right now, they don't block my SIM. I'm petrol to enter 800 per liter. I'm like, what's in the apple? <laughs> Who you they ask what's in the apple? We <laughs> said, go ask you what's in the apple. All right, let's go on a quick break, ladies and gentlemen, and the conversation continues. Welcome back to the show, guys. Welcome. Before we went on the break, it was True Senior Monday, and we're asking the question, what are your goals for the second half of the year 2024? And we've received some calls, we've gotten some messages, and uh, we are still on social media. I'm back on Facebook. And King Zanda Omar says, getting admission and closer to God. So now people are talking about getting close to God. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Cypher Max says, second half the year to rap the same rate as Eminem. At least I can rap Godzilla. You can? Mm. I wish you can call so that we'll hear everything. Mm. <laughs> um, okay. Um, King Zanda again is saying that getting admission. Yeah, yeah, he said that earlier. Okay, back on X at Wells underscore Nation says, all more now to just survival and stay LD. Oton. Before. Before, before. <laughs> at Sheikh Pelumi says, my goal is to make more money and push, mo and push music more. Hmm. Okay, that's Young L Baby, Sheikh Fumi One. Let me see. Oh, songwriter. Hmm. Yeah, a Lil Baby fan. Yeah, a Manche Manchester United fan. Hey. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Omo um, Jesu um, says, just to be in good health, then other things can follow. Nice. We have Jude Eboka at Junaldo underscore seven. And he is saying, me, not to follow woman. Oh, that's your plan again. <laughs> Jude Eboka uh, at Junaldo <laughs> underscore seven. Your remaining plan for this year, 2024. Mm. You say not to follow woman, no. You now continue, you say not woman sure. Uh-uh. OK. So what will woman do for him? <sighs> we just lost one. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you lost one? What if he's looking for a wife? And you know, the Bible says he will find a wife has found a good thing. Mm-hmm. OK. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, 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 tr I'm trying. <laughs> Jude, because continue what you are doing, you know. Um, Sheikh, Sheikh, at Sheikh me one now replies. He says, OJ, I saw what you did there. Hmm. Paint Chelsea fan, and you want to start career. Ah! And, you, and you want to push, and you want to push your musical <laughs> career. Don't let me start with you. <laughs> you this, ah. you this, you this man you fan, you know, when you get level. Go sit down. <laughs> Do you still have more? No, I'm reactions? done for now. So, uh, Sheikh, well, let me one. Don't look for my trouble. Just uh -huh. go and fo focus on your club. That will never win any trouble. Okay, yeah, wow. I'm done. Wow, we're done. Yes, we're done. I just have to two. do that. We're done with everything. King OJ is over. <laughs> you won. One zero knockout stage. Yes, you won. Sheikh, for me, reply, reply, reply. I'm waiting for a reply. Uh -uh. You're still waiting? Yeah. We're done with the show for today. <laughs> and we hope you had an amazing time. Yes, it's the Monday edition of East Splash. And we hope your lunch hour was entertaining. Mm -hmm. Thanks to us. Splash. Mm -hmm. I did the show with King OJ, His Royal Highness, and His Flyness, and myself, Lady Cat, our Royal Highness. And we say, make it a day tomorrow at 12 p.m. Splash continues. Bye for now, guys.